Good morning, Nourish Me community. It's Jolene coming to you live from the Woodland Valley Farm. And I'm here with Fabian, a dedicated chicken lover, egg farmer, pasta maker. This man has got so many talents and I'm just absolutely loving being here on the farm with these chickens. We decided to start a little bit earlier. The girls are needing to have some lunch soon and it's getting very, very hot. So we're gonna jump straight in and Fabian's gonna tell us all about these gorgeous girls and just what it takes to look after these chickens and to grow the most nutritious and delicious egg. Hi everybody, Fabian here. Uh, welcome to our farm. Um, we're here in, uh, with one of our chicken caravans uh, to talk to you about pasture raised eggs today. Uh, we've got around a thousand uh, highline brown uh, egg producing chickens on the farm in four separate caravans and they're here to do two things they're here to regenerate our pastures and they're also here to provide you with amazing uh, nutrient rich nutrient dense uh, pasture raised eggs the caravan that we're at's got about 420 450 chickens in it um, and you can see at the moment they're fenced in with some electric netting that's there to protect them from wild dogs during the evening and early morning and then later in the day once they've finished laying their eggs uh, they'll be let out to uh, free range across the, the farm and they'll scratch up uh, worms and bugs and grubs and also eat a lot of uh, a lot of grass uh, which provides chlorophyll which gives you the nice golden yolk that you're used to when you get a, a pasture raised egg the beauty about having free range pasture raised eggs is that you get a higher density of nutrition in our egg and also you get a really fresh product and one of the other benefits is ethically uh, ethically produced eggs and you can see the girls down here on the ground doing what chicks love to do, uh, making dust baths and you just won't see that in a commercial, commercial factory. These girls get the best lives, they get uh, lots of sun, lots of shade, lots of green grass, lots of bugs, and as a result, we get amazing eggs for you guys to come and buy at the markets. And these eggs are absolutely de delicious. I bought some last week and I think they were gone in three days. They most certainly taste a lot nicer than your supermarket variety and they are way more nutritious. Eggs are a fascinating food, they're a complete superfood as well as they contain all the essential amino acids in the perfect ratios. So nature's really got it right by putting these beautiful animals on the planet. Aren't they gorgeous? And look at this rooster here, couldn't be happier. So this Real rooster's stud. here with the girls, what he does is he um, He's a protection uh, rooster for the girls, so when we get predators like uh, sea eagles or uh, wedge-tailed eagles, he'll uh, give out a cry and the girls will run under the uh, green tunnels or into the caravan uh, to protect themselves from the eagles as well. We'll and go inside now and we'll have a look at uh, the eggs on the car in, inside the caravan. Sure, and Fabian was telling me before that probably two of these girls get swept up by eagles every week. Yeah, it's an unfortunate part about uh, pasture raised egg farming. Um, it's most definitely the most difficult way to um, produce an egg, but it is one of the unfortunate uh, uh, implications of having chickens out in the open. We can't control all of the predators, we can't control all of the conditions, the heat, the cold, and uh, subsequently, yeah, we do lose some chickens each week to the, to the eagles for sure. Pop in here, we'll get to see um, how the girls give us their wonderful little bounties of joy. This is a conveyor belt system, so the girls pop in into these nesting boxes where they'll lay the egg. The egg will roll down onto a conveyor belt. We'll put our egg tray here, roll the conveyor belt in. Eggs for everybody. As easy as that. Beautiful, look at that. The eggs just um, come off the conveyor belt perfectly clean. Uh, we don't wash our eggs, and what that does is leave the cuticle on the outside of the egg, which is a natural protection that the chicken puts on um, to stop bacteria penetrating the shell. And as a consequence of having that cuticle on, the eggs don't need to be refrigerated to keep them fresh and stop them from uh, spoiling as quickly. 
So Fabian, tell me, how many eggs do you think we should be eating a week? Ooh. <laughs> Are you asking me from a health perspective? A health perspective. <laughs> <laughs> Two or three, eggs, I think. Eating eggs is um, hugely beneficial to human, um, to the human body nutritionally. Um, I'm not sure what they recommend. We eat a lot, <laughs> um, and I consider myself quite healthy. So yeah. yeah you look healthy and so you can find Fabian and his beautiful wife Jody at markets around the northern rivers so on Tuesday they're at the New Brighton market on Wednesday they're in Mwoolumba Friday they're in Mullanbimby and what was the other day? Uh, Wednesday, uh, Thursday, at Currumbin. Thursday at the Currumbin community market. community market so currently they're selling out because everybody's starting to catch on how amazing these eggs are but don't worry about it, they've got another 500 chickens on the way. On the way. So there'll be plenty of eggs for all of us.